What's happening? This is Beta Ray Ben, and today we're going to showcase a show called Black Scorpion. Debuting in 2001, Black Scorpion was an action detective show, like a superhero motif similar to Buffy the Vampire Slayer and Witchblade. It's actually a lot like Witchblade, to where you have a no-nonsense, hard-nosed detective whose father gets shot by a corrupt politician, as if one would ever exist. Uh, <laughs> and um, she takes to the streets as a vigilante uh, in a very Batman-like form, to where she'll have like a, a vehicle and gadgets and a super suit rather than having any kind of superpowers like uh, Witchblade. Uh, but the episode that I want to show you guys today, man... It's got Dave Mustaine in it. Lead singer and lead guitarist of Megadeth. Dave Mustaine. Yeah, you heard me right. Dave Mustaine is in this. He plays a supervillain that can start fires. It's fucking awesome. I saw this after Star Trek The Next Generation late night on UPN. I believe it was UPN. I had rabbit ears at the time. I was 10 years old. Or I was a kid. I don't know how old I was. I do a lot of drugs. I don't do a lot of drugs. I do a little bit of drugs. I did a little bit of drugs. I don't do drugs anymore. <laughs> Bear with me if you don't mind. Uh, all right. So let's go ahead and start watching this episode of Black Scorpion. It's a, it's a very much villain of the week formulaic show. So you'll be able to get right into it real quick. Uh, and damn it. I just fucking love Dave Mustaine. I love, I love Dave Mustaine in, in a lot of different areas. Like, I love him, you know, as a creator, as an artist, as a musician. And I would love to see more of him. What am I going to say? I would love to see more of him. Uh, so here it is. Here's Black Scorpion, season one, episode entitled Love Burns. <laughs> Jeez, take it easy. What are you, Bruce Wayne's therapist or something? I mean, come on. <laughs> Scorpions live alone. In fact, the female of the species often chases away or even kills the male after mating with him. Scorpions do most of their mating. That's pretty much hookup culture, right? This scorpion has just devoured her mate. <laughs> As a night dweller, the scorpion is... We interrupt this program to bring you a Channel 8 news break. Do you get the <laughs> foreshadowing? From the television? Where, as you can see behind me, flames are consuming the shelter. <sighs> Most of the homeless have been rescued due to the heroic efforts of a single fireman. A single a fireman? fireman? What? Only a team of firemen can save people. A single fireman? I mean, come on. But you don't get paid to fight fires either, do you? Are there any more fire engines on their way to battle? The hell was that supposed to mean? He's a fireman. Of course he gets paid. Unless he's a volunteer fireman. He doesn't get paid at all. <laughs> Wait a minute. Is that why he doesn't have any uh, co-workers? Is be Fuck, what the hell is with those damn dangly... Ooh, man. I, you can't just show gigantic fun bags like that and expect my brain to still continue to function normally. I mean, it's like throwing a monkey wrench inside the brain gears. It's not fair. I always love this part. It's where the the superhero persona comes out, you know, from the the secret identity. Wait, so he's working alone because of budget cuts? The hell city is this Portland? <laughs> Ah, oh, 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 what the fuck? <laughs> that guy does not have a shirt on? Person is emerging from the smoke. Are there any more of you inside? No, but <laughs> just the firemen. Yeah, the one guy, the one fucking fireman we've been talking about the whole time, he's still in there. The one guy, the one, one guy? Day, dark 
Jason Walker is a cop. But in the dark of night, she becomes a bitch. Black Scorpion. Oh, Black Scorpion, right. Sorry. Doing with a mask what she can't do with a badge. Proper police work. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, man. If you guys like this video a lot, maybe next time we'll do Mantis or, uh, or Nightman. I actually kind of like that car, to be honest. I mean, it's got a cool scorpion on it. What's not to like? They keep reading the same information to pad out the fucking show. It's really bad. Those flames aren't going to burn her ass or anything like that? What the fuck? Coming in here alone is a stupid thing to do. See, like I said, she doesn't have any superpowers. Batman's fully covered, except for, like, his mouth. She is not. She... What the fuck? Ah, fucking powers are all suit. Time to go. So if she can project electricity, then I would assume... I would just assume that there is some kind of layer of electromagnetic armor protecting her skin from the fire. I mean, that's probably what's going on. I would just assume that, because if not, it would just look like the costume designers were horny pervers. Or something. <laughs> I'm getting a... Uh... I'm getting the Dark Knight flashbacks here, man. <laughs> oh, I'm a kind of rugged, attractive man. Ugh. <laughs> was that a model city? What the fuck was that? No. When did you start smoking? Since my old pal Fast Freddy laid his hands on a box of Cuban. Fast Freddy, owner of Didn't Freddy Fazbear's pizza. pizza. You know those are illegal. What are you gonna do? Arrest me? What's what's illegal? A <laughs> cigar? What the fuck? Wait, I'm not afraid of you. Snorkel check. Whippers check. High tech bay watching equipment. Check. I am so having sex with a mermaid tonight. <laughs> well, I think it's funny. What the fuck did you just say? Oh, it was a smooth flight. In the Mile High Club, apparently. Man, the writing of the show is really uh, a lot worse than I remember. Oh, is that what's supposed to spur on the whole her need for a relationship? Uh oh, uh oh. You found her. The big swinging dick just walked in. And uh, there's no smoking here. My name is uh, Adam Burns. A fireman named Burns. It's almost like there's shitty writers attached to this. I caught you on TV last night. Any idea what caused that fire? A better question would be who caused it. Yeah, I got a pretty good idea. Is there he is? that it? <gasps> is that him? Known arsonist. Is that him? Got out of jail two weeks That's ago. him? I recognize his handiwork at the shelter. Well, thanks for the lead. I'll check it out. Thanks Show his picture, please. Can you just give me that? With fucking dollar store Peter That's Weller walking in here? That's what this guy is. He's a fire ready to happen. You've been laid off for this fireman years. looks like and taking a civilian on an if uh, Peter Weller and Will Ferrell had a baby. Regulations. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> the news I read about you in the paper. And I know you took the law into your own hands when you stopped the breath taking. He killed my father. Look, I don't expect you to understand. I do understand. Look, uh, Darcy. Darcy. Detective Walker. Detective Walker. I could have come to any cop in the department, but I came to you. Because you're the main what? character. <laughs> because we have something in common. And what is that exa exactly? 
we both do what we have to do. Oh, that is the biggest load of horseshit I've heard in a long time. Torchy's last known address. Torchy? Have you ever tried to quit? Yeah, what's the point? In my line of work, you can't help but agree to all smoke. A friend of mine smokes cigars. It drives his girlfriend absolutely crazy. The illegal cigars, years? right? <laughs> used to. Used to? It's kind of hard to keep a relationship when you have to run out of the house in the middle of the night. <sighs> I know what you mean. Speaking of running out in the middle of the night... <sighs> there he is! Sorry, I got excited. <laughs> Why the fuck is he driving the car from Jeepers Creepers? <laughs> what the fuck's going on? Dave, you can't steal cars from monsters. I mean, you can, obviously, but you probably shouldn't. Is that why you had to do this show? You stole a car from a monster and you had to pay him off? It happens, you know. Oh, what is this place? It's the city's experimental power plant. I read about it in the paper. Supposedly, it harnesses the sun's energy and stores it in a solar tank. How is that possible? It's simple when you steal it from uh, the man with the golden gun. Yeah, <laughs> that's exactly what they did in that movie. You fuck. You should probably call for backup, though. I mean, he is a super villain. No thanks. I don't like freezing police, but I do like burning them. I like the music, but did they overdub him? Come on, Dave! Oh, damn! <laughs> I didn't mean for you to actually hit him. <laughs> Kick his ass. Come on, he's a super villain. Is this a Megadeth song, or did he write his own music for this? I wonder. Either way, it's, either way, it's fine. What are you spraying on her? <laughs> Did you borrow that shit from Dale's dead bug? <laughs> Did your mother teach you not to play with fire? <sighs> what the f I no. So Dave, what do you want to wear as a supervillain? So your name's Torchy. Your thing is fire. That's your thing? You know, uh, our designers have a costume for you? No, I want to wear a black trench coat and fingerless gloves. I mean, it's him and the Punisher. They've got like the same motif. I am thoroughly enjoying this. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> oh man! Looks like the rest of your life's gonna be sunny and hot, with highs reaching the upper thousands. <laughs> yeah! There we go! Oh man! All right. I enjoyed that a lot. <laughs> I also like this uh, Cleopatra 2025 low-budget sci-fi setup they have here at a power plant. There's a big lever on that fucking console. What does that lever do? Never mind. It was Whatever. Are they listening to Dave Mustaine's fucking theme song on the way after just fighting him? That's the same song, right? Sounds like it. Are you sure? No. No. Don't kiss the fucking botched Peter Weller clone. You know, I might be internalizing a couple things. You know, I did have a nightmare when I was a kid. Right. Or not when I was a kid. I had a nightmare, like, in my fucking 20s. Uh, to yeah. where I was flirting with um, the singer no, from Evanescence. No, no, no. And Please Peter Weller came in you. and cock-blocked me. <laughs> like, entirely. Seriously, who the fuck has an orange truck like that? 
and if that's a Zippo, I call bullshit. Zippo's always light. Oh wow. What the hell? Mm. I mean, I thought the scene where uh, Chris Evans found out he was the Human Torch in Fantastic Four was good, but damn, I mean, uh, cigarette thumb, hot tub in the ice, cigarette thumb, hot tub in the ice. You're right, they both do suck. They didn't train you for any of this shit, buddy? <laughs> what some firefighter you are. <laughs> Everything I had in the world was in my apartment. That's a house. I'm sorry, I don't know what happened. It started on fire and continued to burn. What kind of fireman would anyway? He's the only one in the city, literally. Looks like the rest of your life's gonna be sunny and hot with highs reaching the upper thousands. <laughs> yeah. Thank God they fucking... Thank God they had that line in a second time. My uh, my Dave Mustaine meter was getting low. I had to... I, that, I needed to refuel it. You didn't think you both could have been killed. They're heavily insured. I've got a re-election campaign to finance. Isn't he cute when he sneezed? I was just fucking joking about that shit. Damn. Look at that awful snoring. I'll bet he kept the whole cell block awake. No, the doctor says it's because he's got a deviated rectum. That's a deviated septum, the bet. That, that, don't you have any oh. filing to do? No, we got a manicure yesterday. The bottom line here is I do not want a repeat of what happened last night at the power plant. Don't you worry about a thing. That was just a warm up. Aren't you going to see some real fireworks? I love him. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I, I'm, just, I'm just a huge fan. Well, what can I say? Do you like him? How the fuck did you find him? No. Oh, what do you want? I'm going to take your life just like you took mine. Isn't that obvious, buddy? You hit him in the face with a fucking axe? Still alive. What? Okay, a no, that's not what happened. What the fuck? Everything I work for is gone. I've been smoking. Dude, the city did you wrong. You were the only firefighter. Fucking quit. Oh, that's... Motherfucker. <laughs> Killing is your business, and business is good. Ooh, fuck. Whack! <laughs> now look, what happened was my fault. I mean, it was, though. But. You're worth promise. He wanted the insurance money. That's why he cut down the fire department. That's why there's only one of you motherfuckers. Instead of the building's burned. Work. Well, Torchy, looks like you're the one that's gonna get burned. Oh no! Oh shit! No, Dave! No! Ugh. Hey, Walker. Out, and so falls Dave Mustaine in a weary world. File. Fuck. There just might be something in here that'd be a little bit helpful. Great. You've got a date with the only firefighter of the whole city? How the fuck are you guys ever going to... Fuck. I mean, you're a superhero. He's a firefighter. He's the only firefighter. And you're a superhero. All you have to do is change your gut. It's you different fucking. I, I found something in Torchy's file that you have got to see. Okay, look, this is really bad timing. Can we just do this another? Whoa, this is really bad timing, and it's not like you know this is important or anything. I've got a date. And you 
are not going to believe what's in this file either. Guess who was Torchy's cellmate, hmm? Charles Manson. I don't know. I don't have a whole lot of time for guessing games here. Who? Mo Wu. What? Mo Wu. I... I... It sounds like you're saying his cellmate was Casanova Frankenstein. Was it Casanova Frankenstein? Mayor Worth. Ah! Gotcha. Mayor? Until morning. Well, you don't want the trail to get cold, do you, Doc? Yeah, I mean, it's not like we're trying to protect civilians or property damage or anything like that. Damn! Oh, shit! What the fuck are you wearing? Babette? That's her name? Dude, what the fuck did you fall in? What the hell are you? Yeah. I'm in an inferno. A raging inferno! And you're the one who's enraged me! Me? Okay. What did I do this time? You've endangered countless lives by cutting down the fire department, then ordering Torchy to burn down the building. You look real happy about that, though. Yeah. You're like, hey, you, you killed countless people! Now, uh, Mr. Inferno, mm. uh, is that your name? Um, well, what can we do for you? Uh, my entire office is at your disposal. This guy looks like the predator fell into a fucking landfill. What, what is this outfit he's wearing? Now that I've disposed of your office, I'm going to dispose of you. What do we do? It's uh, the only thing we can do, Babette. Beg. <laughs> oh, uh, please, uh, uh, Mr. Inferno. Politicians are used to begging. Some kind of... It's not like she's your partner or anything and she'd be giving you back up, you dumbass. Get your hands in the... What the fuck is the... What are you wearing, you fucking freak? Get your hands in the air. <laughs> Great. Now, is that guy wearing a helmet from like the old Battlestar Galactica or some shit? Yes, what? Did you get hot in your costume? Not as hot as you're gonna get in yours. Oh, that was dumb. The black scorpion. Oh, thank God you're here. This can you please put your boot on my neck and call me bad? That's the problem I have. <clears throat> I don't like this sniveling coward any more than you do, but I can't let you kill him. And just how do you plan on stopping me? I thought I'd do something like this. <laughs> I'm summoning my After Effects powers! That should cool you off. The villain is seriously defeated by a sprinkler. Right, enough! Everyone with a mask on is under arrest! <laughs> I don't know how to make that into a 2021 joke. I don't, okay? You can. You make that a 2021 joke in your mind. Everyone with that fucking mascot is on her back. Scorpion. No, she's the guy after Inferno. Which is weird, because you smell and talk the same. Do you wear the same perfume or something? Because, uh, I mean, I was in the room with her, I was in the room with you. It's the same person almost. Weird. Weird how that shit is. Damn. <laughs> He's hotboxing it, man. Because of those. Mmm. Smoke detectors? Tend to love and put them up all over the damn place. Wait, yeah, but you don't need to smoke in my car. Don't worry. You so I'm pretty sure smoke. the cigar a lot of is some type of allegory for weed. But it was 2001, and weed was still uh, just in case things heat up with completely taboo, unfortunately. What are you two morons doing? The fuck? Well, you wouldn't let us take a vacation. So we decided to take our own. Yeah, we haven't got your phone card. Let me see. Oh, this one's yours. Here you go, Cap. Enjoy. Dear Captain, the weather's here. Wish you were beautiful. This joke <laughs> is too good. My office. 
for the other guys. Really? Remember that movie with Will Ferrell and uh, Max Payne himself, Mach Wahlberg? You know what's weird? You look like a lot like a, like the woman who kicked the shit out of me last night. I mean, I walked into the mayor's office wanting to burn him, and then some lady came in and just quiet? beat the shit out of me. You look like her. That's weird. There's something I need to tell you, but... My ass is out of focus. <laughs> I have something to tell you, too, but every time I'm around you, I just... I melt. There's a reason for that. It's because... It's because he's, he's, he's wearing the jeans from the Scorpion album cover, Animal Magnetism? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think it's why I'm so afraid. You're afraid? This whole thing scares the hell out of me. So I guess we've, uh, we've both been burned. Wait a minute. Ugh. What are you trying to tell me? Dude, the puns. What I'm trying to tell you is... The puns are painful. I think I'm falling for you. Uh-huh. Isn't that what you're trying to tell me? Actually, yeah, it is. it's uh... no. <laughs> Actually, I was trying to tell you that I shop at the same store Beetlejuice does. Oh, it's a steamy sex scene from a TV show. We're about to see nothing. Oh, damn! Wait a minute. When he gets turned on, he starts shit on fire. God. All right. <laughs> the fuck. Is that like the secret uh, entrance to her scorpion the, lair or something? It's under her bed. It's a good thing I had a fireman in my bed. I'd say that's what she said, but she did. <laughs> this is what happens when you're not funny. <laughs> I can't do this. What? What's wrong? Adam? Adam? <laughs> this video is sponsored by Blue Chew. Because I'm afraid you'll of commitment. I'm afraid you'll get burned. <laughs> I will burn things. <laughs> Damn. Avril O'Neill's apartment's on fire. <laughs> Wow. This is an amazing scene. A pig roast? Because you're starting cops on fire. Very funny. I don't know what's, what is more enjoyable. The horrible special effects, the costume, or the fucking action. I mean, it's all filmed so weird. What the fuck? I want a car that can do that. I also want the black scorpion outfit and everything. I mean, I think I could rock a phone. I mean, if as long as the mask fits, you know, if the mask covers my face, I think I can rock the whole black scorpion ensemble. Coincidentally, this episode has really good music. I haven't seen a chase scene like this since Bullet. We keep shooting, but nothing's working. What do we do now? Continue to shoot him! Oh, that... I know what's going on. This is the beginning from Phantom Pain, right? Yeah! This is the beginning of fucking Phantom Pain! Ooh. Ooh. 
<laughs> My After Effects powers are stronger than your After Effects powers! I fireball freeze! Hands on your helmet! Looks like it's time for you boys to get a new car! Actually, we just got this one! Oh, I mean, it's I'm not ready to for- Ah, oh, fuck! You don't know how right you are. Dude, Schwarzenegger is getting hard of all, all these puns. Mr. Freeze is at least loving these. Mortal Kombat? <laughs> It's like they're trying to punch the moths around their costumes. They're eating all the plastic or fabric. Looks like we have something in common. We both hey, love getting that? hurt. We both can't fight. <laughs> we both do what we have to do. Oh. I didn't recognize you by looking at your face. Ninja Vanish! Believe that this supervillain is merely full of hot air. Oh no! Inferno! What the fuck was that? Inferno! <laughs> and just replace Mr. Freeze with Inferno? Is that what happened? This is the exact same plot. With the satellite and all that shit. Only instead of freezing the city, he's burning. You know, getting the code to work for the transform machine or whatever on removing those fucking earrings when the mask comes on, that must have been hard to program. Well, look who's here. Did you come by to rekindle an old flame? Whoa, oh, stop. Stop. <laughs> they just keep digging. Let's dig them puns deeper. I've reset the flow of the reflector. Adam. Instead of collecting heat, I can discharge it over 5,000 times the power. Did you hear what I just At said? At least we're glad we're that they didn't use the words, well. I'm going to reverse the polarity. Yeah. Like they do in every comic I book agree. and TV show. And? I'm doing what I have to do. Light the whole city on fire, because they only hired one fucking firefighter. I have been through hell and back. Now there's a fire inside me. Weirdly I enough, it always comes back to that. Day, like, body, this guy was driven insane because away. he's the only fucking firefighter in the city. I'm saying that you have to fight fire with fire. I can't. Then watch the city of angels burn to the ground. Adam, stop. I can't. It's up to you. What do you mean it's up to me? Do what you have to do. The writers didn't give me any dimension. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> you just fucking kill him! <laughs> you fucking vaporize them! Like you're fucking Marvin the Martian or some shit. You turn into a pile of dust! My preliminary investigation is shit. Oh. That Torchy Thompson worked for Adam Burns. Oh. All right, that was pretty awesome. Known as Inferno. I liked that a lot. And as your mayor, 
I am taking steps to ensure the last time I saw someone get turned into powder, I was watching the old 1960s Batman movie you know, it doesn't seem to where they turned the city council into powder or some shit. What about you? I just wished I could have saved Adam. It wasn't your fault, Blue. Dude, yeah! <laughs> what? <laughs> Sounds like somebody. Instead of vaporizing him, she could have just put him in handcuffs and arrested him. You didn't have to fucking kill the guy. He had, a, he had his back to her. <laughs> well, how do you like that? You can teach an old dog new tricks. Mm -hmm. mm. Where are you going? To flush these tobacco torpedoes into Angel River. No. <laughs> so tell me the truth. Did she really convince you to give up cigars? No. Nope. Actually, it was your boyfriend. What do you mean? After you I stuck saw what happened to Inferno, I believe the warning labels now. Smoking is hazardous to your health. Dark. Oof. Just stop by to tell you how sorry I am. I also want to tell you how sorry I am for the way I've been acting lately. You were I'm right. a total sleazeball. Maybe it was, maybe it was and it's pretty obvious. Maybe. I mean, the grease just drips off of me. Maybe. I, 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 look, I don't know. I, why don't we just go to O'Brien's? We'll have a little bit to eat and sort <sighs> something out. You are asking her on a date after her fling just got vaporized? There's something I have to do. <laughs> You're spreading his ashes over the city! You fucking did that shit! That was all- You vaporized him! Did I- Did I not- Did I, did, did I miss something? Or was that- Whatever. Roger Corman. Of course!